Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading update. Uh, nice day of trading today, booked over 1800 in profits, $1,816 and 50 cents. Uh, stayed really small this morning. I actually had a, ran into a little technology issue. Those were in the live stream. Know what I'm talking about. I was, I was trying to open my, um, my Tastyworks platform and it just kept getting stuck on download. Uh, other people said that theirs works fine, so I'm not sure what the problem is with mine. So anyway, I had to improvise and trade on toss today. So here is the breakdown. Let me uh, let me just show you these, and then we'll jump into the charts. Took a couple uh, little trades on one in the Russell 2000, uh, lost 23 bucks on that one. On the micro ES, lost 40, and then made about 60 on the Nasdaq. Uh, so all all around in the futures, pretty much a scratch. Apple did a mighty 90 trade, booked 261 there. Uh, AMD caught a runner for 384. Uh, Amazon caught a runner for 565. Minus 115 on Boeing. Uh, nice winner on Beyond of 835. Caught a nice runner there. Facebook minus 140. MU minus 250. Netflix plus 466. Nicola minus 294. Piton 220. And Tesla took two different trades. One was a winner, one was a loser. A uh, little, little negative there. But overall, great day. 1816.50. And I was done by noon. I think I closed my last one out at like 10 after 12 central time. So let's take a look at what we did here. Uh, on the futures to start with, just I was trying to catch, I was trying to catch some runners, and they just uh, kind of flushed me out pretty quick. So I just cut my losses really quick. Been doing a great job at just cutting losses and letting these winners run. Uh, in Apple, let's take a look at Apple, our first mighty ninety trade. So we had this big flush down, and so as, as volume was popping here, I uh, entered my first piece here, and then my second piece here. Ended up closing out after we got this green bar, so booked about 200, uh, not about, exactly 261 in profits. Facebook, my other Mighty 90 trade. Uh, this is one where we took this short, uh, actually got short about right here. And this thing just kind of kept kind of pushing, pushing higher. Not really a push so I could add, but just kind of a, a slow push. And then when this came down here, I ended up just getting out, taking a small loss. It ended up being a, would have been a nice winner. But uh, with these mighty 90s, we really want a quick reaction. And when I didn't get it, I went ahead and just cut out. So ended up taking a loss that could have been a, one, a win. But PL is your only truth. So it's a loss. Uh, let's see. So Amazon, let's take a look at Amazon. Amazon was a nice winner. I booked 565 here. And in Amazon, what I was, what I was looking at here is uh, whenever price kind of made this big push higher and it, it it broke trend and it broke above these highs here and then started to consolidate. The market started getting stronger. And so I took a little long runner here and caught a piece of this and then did the same thing there. So caught a couple little pieces on the upside of Amazon. Uh, the other big winner was, well, let's look at Netflix. Netflix was a nice winner as well. Now, this Netflix was a winner, but it was actually a little bit frustrating because it just took so long to come together. Uh, so price made this big push out of the gate and then just started to come down and consolidate. And so I, I got I got long. Um, I think it was right right in this area. And then I added here. I took off there. It was just kind of bouncing around. I added it again there, took one off there, added again there. And then finally, uh, and this is 11 a.m. now at this point, finally it broke out and I, 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 I took pieces off all the way up during that little little up move there. So that was a nice little runner. Uh, the other nice one, my other, my biggest winner, $835 profit was in Beyond Meat. So in Beyond, uh, what I did here is uh, we had this big push higher, but then it came down and then it pushed right back up. And so, uh, you know, it dipped into negative territory, said, nope, we don't like that, made a big push higher, and then just started to consolidate around this pivot and around yesterday's high. And so that's when I, that's when I got in, kind of bounced around a little bit longer, and then boom, I caught this thing all the way up to the pivot uh, so got a got a nice little runner there. Also caught a nice little runner in Peloton when it started to consolidate here, 
and took uh, took this up to the up to that pivot there, uh, which is good because it fell apart uh, about 20 minutes later. So really nice trades, just staying super small, but still able to book over 1800 bucks in profit. Never used more than $8,000 in, in buying power at any one time. So good stuff, uh, really coming in to our own on uh, being able to manage these runners and can't wait to uh, to provide this class to you all. We'll be rolling it out very soon. I know I know a lot of you are anxious to kind of get the details. If you're, if you're watching us live in the live stream room, we talk about it every day and I'm, I'm giving you all my thoughts, all my criteria for what I'm going to do. Uh, but we'll, we'll roll out the official class here in the next several weeks. So hope everybody had a great day. We will be streaming live again tomorrow morning, 8.30 a.m. to 10 a.m. Central. See you there.